Ai, 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 Oh no! Is that hard? Eh? Hey, you're Mama Sari to hey, hey, hey. send an email. Oh, okay, okay. okay. To an Italian chef. I'm confident. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs>
So instead of using oil, I decided to use butter. Mm. For now, oh shit! <laughs> See, it got shit man. You need to take out. Okay, while I'm preparing the sauce, I should cook the pasta. The previous episode that I did, which was salmon, he told me he was so triggered when he watched it. He was like, why you cut the salmon? Oh no, my first time cooking salmon, right? And he said, it's okay. I just give you some tips. First, you must season well. Whatever you do, add garlic. Um, hi Axel, if you are watching this, I would like to apologize for not paying attention when you cook carbonara in the past. Okay, okay, okay. Uh -huh, uh -huh. After one or two episodes, I learned already. You must salt your water. One. They say, I don't know who say, but they say this hole is for you to measure. Hafi say ada. Then don't trust. Ah, uh, your. I'm gonna dice into cubes. Okay, okay. We want our pasta to be al dente. Oh my god, I suddenly remember. Axel gave me another tip yesterday. He said, always taste what you cook. A bit crunchy. Okay, too bad a bit. For just a while. Oh, the colour does look a bit like carbonara colour. A bit. A bit. Will the oil affect the wetness? Yeah, I never take the the Ladies and gentlemen, I present Switching up my positions for you in the kitchen and in the bedroom. <laughs> Give me a bit of this. Gotta look off, gotta look off. Okay, mix everything. But well, it's not very hot. Pour your sauce in. Okay, then keep on mixing. Hey, hey, hey guys! The last time it's not like that. The last time the moment I pour in, right? It becomes fried egg. Don't talk. Keep stirring. It looks so much better than Hafiz. Eh? Oh, I want to thank, um, firstly, Exo. But most importantly, myself. Okay, so this is my final product. It is a carbonara, not fried noodle, not Hokkien Mee. Wow, the smell of the milk very strong. Okay, not gonna lie, but I'm damn nervous. Eh. Wow, what is Guan Charlie? Okay, so my ingredient to make a carbonara, which I think it will turn out like a carbonara is um, cheese. This looks more premium than the turkey bacon inside, so that's why I choose that. Fresh milk, mushroom, cooking cream, definitely need your eggs, salt and black pepper, and because I prefer linguine. I'm trying to remember all the recipes I've learned on TikTok. I need to prep before cooking anything. Because I, I have mushroom here, right, so I need to saute it with um, garlic. Give a bit of like flavor. How do I like my carbonara? Um, creamy. A good carbonara is very hard to make. When was the last time I chopped garlic? Was eight years ago. Closet got them ready. Okay. I don't even know how to deal with this. Sorry to all Italians out there. I've never made pasta before. Do you put salt right after it boils or before? I'm just trying to visualize the TikTok video that I, I used to watch. In the kitchen and in Doesn't the bed. Matter. Okay. It's very little, leh, the pasta. Hafiz method don't work. Lah. 
Let's give it two minutes, then I'll check back in. I'm thinking which one I should start first, like the mushroom or the guanciale. Because this one is very quite thick, so I scared it will take quite a while. My boobs are sweating because I'm scared. Actually, I should put the oil in now. Okay! <laughs> Wake up already. Ooh, 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 ooh. Mm, mm. Yep. Wow, smells good already, bro. You don't want to burn garlic because then it will be bitter. I need more oil. I'm just going to put the one chali inside now. Like You're taking a bit long ah, to cook. Gordon Ramsay also say season your food. I want it to be brown, golden, and like crispy on the outside. Okay, I'm gonna prepare my egg yolk first. Perfect! I think this is the colour that I want. Take a good, good uh, side of me, yeah. So that I can put it on my Tinder profile also. My egg! My egg! <laughs> okay, I'm bringing the heat back up. But it's not melting the cheese, eh. Dude, the consistency <laughs> does not look great, man! Oi! Wait, no, 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 don't do this to me. I might have just overcooked the egg. Lah. Oi, no, lah, it does not look good. Leh. <laughs> I am so freaking disappointed in myself. <laughs> You make me taste this. Remind me of how much of a failure I am. <laughs>
so that I can transfer it to the pan and carry on cooking from there. When you're cooking pasta, I always make sure you stir your noodles like during the first few minutes so that your noodles don't clump together or like stick to the pot. I got throw it at the fridge. No! Who, do, who did that? What does throwing the pasta at your fridge tell you? That it can stick? <laughs> don't waste food, just put in your mouth. One more minute. I'm gonna cook it at a very low heat because I don't want to scramble the eggs. I'm gonna try the pasta to see whether it's cooked. Are you? It's not going in my mouth. Just put in your mouth. Okay, just shut up, al dente. I can finish the cooking in the pan here. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna transfer the noodles over to my pan. I'm gonna add a bit of pasta water inside as well. The water from the pasta and the fats from the guanciale actually emulsifies to give you a sauce, you see? So I'm gonna try to make sure that the eggs don't touch the bottom of the pan, if not, they'll cook. So as you can see, the sauce is starting to form, right? It's a very nice, thick, creamy sauce. A bit more pasta water in. So the residual heat from the pasta is actually cooking the sauce. You see how creamy it is? Woo! <laughs> oh my god, it's so freaking creamy. I just uh, taste uh, quite a bit of the chili flakes or spiciness. So in these episodes of uh, my colleague's last meal, we have <laughs> Gladys. Help me! It's not as bad as I thought it would yeah. be. I thought the egg would be too gelat also. Yeah, but it's still okay. I think the spice helped. Ah, yes. Help Those who cannot cook, remember, just <laughs> add spicy chili things flakes. to it. Yeah. Ah, good luck. Ah, I prepare seasoning uh, just in case. When she was done cooking everything, the cooking cream smell was very strong. Mm. The turkey bacon got that saltiness to it, right? So it's still okay, not too bad. You try one more time. Yeah, the salt. <laughs> the guanciale was a good choice because it added another texture, crunchy on the outside and then like softer in the inside. It doesn't taste like carbonara, la, really. <laughs> Sao mian, ah. I think of the guanciale. Mm -hmm. like, there's this like... Like a bit gamier than... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Than, than your usual yeah. bacon. If you saute the guanciale first, mm. then got the oil, the greasiness and everything. You can just add in the onions and garlic already. The sauce, you did it correctly. Just that you put too long. It overcooked, right? So mm. it became more of like scrambled eggs. But the pasta is nice. Okay, not just that Just the bit. sauce. <laughs> <laughs> This is carbonara. I know Math knows how to cook carbonara. <laughs> so, I'm very, very excited to try it. Come on, please tell me it's nice. <laughs> it's definitely creamy. It's less gamey than the previous one. Part of the gaminess actually comes from the pecorino cheese also. So if you don't like gamey stuff, use pancetta and use parmigiano reggiano. Yeah, so if you prefer like less meaty, you can make it with that. Yeah, correct. Yeah. How would I rate this dish? A one five? I think a four. Okay, you're fired. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for watching this episode of How You Cook It. If you like this video, you can watch more over there. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And comment down below what else you'd like to see us cook next. Bye!